Hey guys, it is Dewey here from Dewey TCG, and today I'm bringing you. I found six uh, Duelist Alliance packs. Uh, even though these, you can't pretty much get them anywhere at all. But I'm hoping again to pull the cover card um, if I can. But um, anything else nice would be excellent. So uh, let's get started with the Duelist Alliance packs. Haven't opened these in a while. I'm hoping for some good cards. Any secret rare is welcome in my book. Okay, so what do we get? Spy, sea spy. Perform power, swordfish. Uh, battery man, nine volt. Recover, break of the dark, magical warrior, and perform a power, hip hippo. Satana, the melodious diva. Jin, demolisher of rituals, and monarch, storm forth. So, probably the best card is Break of the Dark Magical Warrior. Still not a bad card. All these packs are first edition. Uh, unfortunately, there's only one way to actually get these packs, and that's through the last edition. But that's still, like, full price, so... Yeah. And I already did open a deluxe edition, so... You know. Uh, Battle Guard Rage, Statella Nova Wave. Shadow Scormata, Chaos Seed, Flash Knight, and the Monarch Storm Forth. Yang Zing Unleashed, um, Nefarious Archfiend of Eater of Nefariousness, and Fishball Doctor. So we get another Flash Knight, so now I've got a plate set of Flash Knights. It's pretty cool. Pack number three. Let's hope we get something awesome. Performer Pal, Swordfish, Gaia the Polar Knight, Hippo Carnival, Scrum, the Mandela, uh, Mandalance of the Burning Abyss, Pendulum Back, which is a hollow, not bad. So if you have two cards in your Pendulum Zone, target two monsters in your graveyard with each levels between the exclusive Pendulum Scales. Um, and then send it back to the Pendulum Zone, add them back to your hand. Not bad. Uh, we also got Super Heavy Samurai Swordsman, which is kind of hard to get actually. Uh, Yang Zing, uh, Feast of the Wild, and Pendulum Back. Haven't actually got that card, that's not bad. Not bad if you're running a Pendulum deck. Mainly, you need to buy Pendulum Dragon if you want to run, run a Pendulum deck. Just because it can destroy itself and then it can search out a Magician. Okay, Battle Guard Rage, Hippo Carnival, Battery Man 9 Volt, Statelanite Ukiya, Ukikali, uh, C, a Malbranch of the Burning Abyss, and, ooh, Falkholt's Cannon, not bad. Pilgrim Reaper, Jin Demolisher of the Rituals. So I haven't actually got that card either. It says during in your end phase, when this if this card was activated this turn, you can target one face-up spell or trap card on the field and destroy it. That's pretty cool. And I think we're down to the last. The last. Oh no, we got one, two more to go. Not bad. So two more to go. Two more chances to pull Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon, or if I can a Dante, that'd be amazing. Archfiend Lancia, Draco Ascension, number 58 Burning Visor, Statana Alpha, UA Perfect Ace, and Satana the Melodious Diva. Uh, Jin Demolisher Rituals, Shadow Hedgehog, and Statana Vega. So, Perfect Ace, that's not bad if you want to build UAs. Okay, final pack. Come on, you know you want to give me my old eyes. But I'd like to do them again. Is that or a Dante? That'd be amazing. Chain Dispel. Aria, the Melodious Diva. Chaos Seed. Battle Guard Rage. Uh, another Mel Branch of the Burning Abyss. Hymn of Light. Unfortunately, no super or rare or anything like that. Uh, Guy of the Midnight Sun. Perform Power Skater Skimmer. And Super Heavy Samurai Swordsman. So we got a couple of Burning Abyss cards, not exactly the one that was after, but that's okay. 
So that wraps it up for the Duelist Alliance packs. I hope you guys enjoyed. We got uh, Falkolt's Cannon uh, and Pendulum back. That were probably the best cards we probably got out of the packs. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more openings because I'm really excited about the next opening. See you then.